Hi, I'm Ms. Polzak and I'm teaching writing. This week we are learning how to write an informational book. Remember, when we write information, we're telling facts. Facts are real and true. They can be right and they can be wrong. Yesterday we did the first three steps of writing an informational book. We thought of an idea, we planned across our fingers, and we wrote everything we know. Today we are going to think of questions our readers might have, explain them using twin sentences, and draw a picture with labels to help explain our work. When we think of questions our readers might have, we need to reread what we wrote and put a question mark over any part that could be confusing or that we might need to explain some more. For example, I wrote koalas are marsupials. My readers might not know what a marsupial is, so I need to explain that with my next sentence. Marsupials are mammals that have pouches. If there's any part that you were vague, you might want to Google or otherwise research to make a more specific fact. For example, I wrote, koalas sleep a lot. I can make that more specific by saying, koalas sleep 18 hours every day. Now that you have written twin sentences to explain the questions your readers might have, you need to draw a picture and use labels to help explain what is happening. Today in writing, you will write sentences to explain questions your readers might have, and you will draw a picture including labels to help explain all of your work. I'm really excited to learn more about your passions.